Welcome to the Simsigus Master. Today we will learn about the most important emergency injections. They use root up administration, usual dose and possible side effects. These are essential for exams and for real life nursing practice. Let's get started. The first one is adrenaline, epinephrine. It is used in anaphylaxis, cardiac arrest, and severe asthma attacks. It is injected intramuscularly in the thigh or intravenously in emergencies. The usual other dose is 0.5 mg intramuscularly for anaphylaxis, 1 mg intravenously during cardiac arrest. It may cause fulfitations, hypertension, and tremors. The second one is atropine. It is used in bradycardia and organophosphate poisoning. It is injected intravenously or intramuscularly. Its usual dose is 0.5 up to 1 mg intravenously every 3 up to 5 minutes, maximum 3 mg. It may cause dry mouth, blood vision, urinary retention. The third one is hydrocortisone. It is used in acute adrenal crisis, severe asthma and anaphylaxis. It is also injected intravenously or intramuscularly. Its usual dose for adult is 100 mg intravenously every 6 up to 8 hours. It may cause hyperglycemia, mood changes, immunosuppression. The fourth one is magnesium sulfate. It is used in eclampsia seizures and severe free eclampsia. It is injected intravenously or intramuscularly. Its usual dose for adult is 4 gram intravenously loading dose then 1 gram per hour infusion. It can cause flushing, hypotension, respiratory depression. The fifth one is calcium gluconate. It is used in magnesium sulfate toxicity, hypoglycemia, hyperkalemia induce cardiac arrest. It is injected intravenously slowly. Its usual dose is 10 ml of 10% solution IV slowly. It may cause bradycardia, hypotension, local irritation. Our number 6 is naloxone. It is used in opioid overdose and respiratory depression due to opioids. It is injected intravenously, intramuscularly or subcutaneously. Its usual dose is 0.4 up to 2 mg intravenously every 2 up to 3 minutes. It can cause nausea, vomiting, agitation. The next one is glucagon. 
It is used in severe hypoglycemia when IV glucose is not available. It is injected intramuscularly or subcutaneously. Its usual dose is 1 mg IM or SC may repeat after 15 minutes. It may cause nausea, vomiting and headache. Number 8 is Purosamide. It is used in acute pulmonary edema and severe hypertension with fluid overload. It is injected intravenously. Its usual dose for adult is 20 up to 40 mg intravenously slow injection. It can cause dehydration, electrolyte imbalance, and hypertension. Number 9 is dobutamine. It is used in cardiogenic shock and severe heart failure. It is injected intravenously as infusion. Its dose is 2 up to 20 mcg per kilogram per minute IV infusion. It can cause arrhythmias headache and trachycardia and number last is dopamine it is used in shock unresponsive to fluid and hypertension it is injected intravenously Its usual dose for adult is 2 up to 10 mcg per kg per minute IV infusion. Its side effects may be tachycardia, arrhythmias, chest pain.